Mika Yamamoto was a veteran of the Iraq and Afghan conflicts, frequently risking her life for which she had won prestigious awards. She's seen here with her father, who paid tribute to Mika as a wonderful reporter and daughter. He described how she was always talking about tragic people who were caught up in conflicts about human lives and world peace. Allahu Akbar. These are pictures of the latest fighting in Aleppo, where she was traveling with rebel troops when she was shot by Syrian soldiers. Mika died before reaching hospital. Her husband, also a long-time colleague, was traveling with her. I couldn't save her. I couldn't. So she, she, she is my right side behind. So two or three meter, so right side. I couldn't see immediately they shooting, shoot it. So distance is 20 or 30 meters. I recognize their face. And immediately they open fire. The rebels she was with immediately gave a warning to foreign journalists. We welcome all the media and journalists who come here. We secure their entry, but we are not responsible for Assad's killing and the attacks on foreign journalists and even Syrian journalists. We are not safe here. Every journalist who enters enters at their own responsibility, or the responsibility of their countries or the organization they work for. Mika Yamamoto is the fourth foreign journalist to die in Syria's conflict. Humphrey Hawksley, BBC News.